So you want to cool your CPU to sub-zero temperatures. Basically, you can do that with something like ice, or you can get yourself a heat pump. And what better heat pump is there than a solid state Peltier cooler? Let's jump straight into this and see whether this is a viable option to cool your CPU below zero degrees. Last time I made a video on thermoelectric cooling, it failed dramatically as I used a CPU with a very high TDP, namely the Pentium 4 series, and the Peltier module wasn't powerful enough to dissipate the heat during the summer. So this time I'm going ahead and cheating a little bit by choosing the AMD E1 1500 APU. I've chosen this one because it has a TDP of 18 watts. This is going to be achievable and we will definitely see a thermal improvement using a Pelty module. So after applying a tiny amount of thermal paste and applying the Pelty module on top of it, we will be able to sit the aluminium heatsink back on it. In case the aluminium heatsink is not effective enough, we have another copper based one to try with it. Alright, now's the moment of truth and hopefully it works the way I expect it to. So step one is probably to turn on the power supply and get the Peltier cooling down the CPU first of all. Next step would be to plug in the motherboard and get that powered on as well. And there we go, it's powered on now and the fan is spinning. I'll now open Core Temp, which is a program used to measure CPU temperature. Just for reference sake, this CPU generally idles at the 40 to high 40s mark. All right, using the thermometer, we can see that the heatsink over here is about 38 C right now. So what this is telling us is it's not good enough at dissipating the heat. Time to switch this on and see whether this fan is more effective at cooling down the system than the other one was. Yes, do continue. And we are at 24C now. 23, 21, 20, and falling. So yes, we might be able to get sub-zero potentially if we crank the power supply just a little bit. I know this module can handle around the 16 mark and we can see we're dropping to about 15C now. Our minimum so far has been 14, 13. All right, this is gonna be my last attempt at trying to get this below zero. So what I've got here is the Peltier module as well as a bowl, metal bowl with some ice water in it. I've recorded this audio in post-production as my Peltier module died on me. It did reach minus 2C and it proves the point that we can get sub-zero using a bowl of ice water. However, I don't think this is practical and if you do want me to revisit this again in the future with a new Peltier module, I will do so. But for the time being, be sure to like, comment and subscribe.